It's important to fail fast. Let me explain to you what I mean by a personal example of where I just recently failed fast. I had an opportunity here with one of the mega mega builders in this country. And I told him, I think that I could double your sales in the next 12 months. I said, I'm a genius marketer. Their marketing sucks. And I said, I could do it for you. He said, wow, I'd love to talk. That's all. I went home and I prepared a business plan for him. I called them at nine o'clock the same day. And I said to him, I would like to come meet you at one o'clock the next day to come prepare for you and show you the business plan that I have. And he said, sure, why not? My wife looked at me, she said, I don't understand. You just had the conversation with him. You're gonna go talk to him already about it. I said, yes, 100%. I wanna see if I have something here. I sit down in the guy's office and I prepare for him the business plan. I show it to him and he says to me, you're out of your mind. The commissions that you're talking about are nothing like what we pay here in Latin America. And he said, unfortunately, it's not a good fit. Great. I walked out. I shook his hand. Thank you for your time. And I went on with my day. Let me tell you why this is an important phenomenon. Because that next week, I had a trade show for one of my other businesses that I was going to. And in my mind, as I'm typing up my business plan the night before, and I was thinking about how much money I'm going to make, how rich I'm going to become from this incredible opportunity. I was thinking to myself, you know what? At the trade show, I don't have to perform my best. Why? Because I am going to have such a successful new business with this construction company here in Panama. And because I had gotten the no fast and I failed fast, I was able to take it out of my mind and use my mind and my energy to build my other businesses so that I could continue to focus on other endeavors without having to waste time and energy and hope for this other construction opportunity. So you understand, you have to fail fast. You have to try things. Too often what we do is we keep our ideas on notepads or we keep them on our computer or even worse, we keep them in our head and we don't execute on those ideas. Why? Because we are afraid to fail because as long as it's in my head, as long as it's in potential, that means that I actually might succeed. But it's actually the opposite. You have to take that idea off of the notepad as soon as you humanly can. And you've got to actually take that idea and test it against the market. And if the market responds in kind, pour gasoline on that fire. If the market says that you don't have something, take it behind the barn and shoot it but take your ideas and test them as soon as you can. Fail fast, fail forward, fail often, because the more you fail, the more you try, eventually you're gonna hit something. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button. Please leave me a comment. Please subscribe to my channel. If you hated the video, let me know in the comments too. I love you guys. Thank you for being a part of my life. Follow me for daily business content. God bless.